What's going on YouTube? It's been a little while, but we're back. Summer is almost upon us, and I've got a lot of new gear and a lot of new reviews to head your way very soon. So, what we got today, the Harley Benton 2x12 cabinet. Now, what's really cool about this cabinet is that it comes loaded with two Celestian Vintage 30 speakers. I did confirm this by opening up the back. And for those of you who don't know about the Celestian Vintage 30 speaker, it is a speaker that everyone goes to for high gain amplifiers, rock tones, metal tones, because it's got a lot of uh, clarity and aggression to it. And it's kind of the speaker of choice for the studio and live scenarios. But the very interesting thing here is that a Celestia Vintage 30 speaker on its own will run you about 145 US dollars. And this cabinet comes with two of them for about 218 US dollars. But the only thing about that is that this cabinet is only available on the Thoman website which is based out of Germany, so if you want one of these cabinets, you gotta import it from Germany. The Thoman website's very good about showing you the shipping fees for what area you're in, and um, for me, it came out to about, uh, I believe, like 260-ish, which is still significantly cheaper than buying two vintage 30 speakers on their own, and then buying a cabinet to go with it, you know? So just some of the quick specs, it is 120 watts in the 8 ohm mono configuration, and it is 60 watts both sides for the 16 ohm stereo configuration. I gotta say that I was very impressed that Thoman delivered it here in California very quickly. It was actually within like a week and a half, so I expected it to take a lot longer. The only thing that was a little scary about the shipping was that when I opened the box, there was little to no protection other than the cardboard. It was wrapped in like a thick plastic bag, and then it had um, four corner cardboard protectors, and that was it. As you can see, the box is kind of tore up from, you know, shipping overseas. So, thankfully, there's not a scratch on this thing at all. So, I can't even call a complaint there, you know. Alright, so the setup today will be a PV6505 mini head, mic'd up with a Shure SM57, going to a Personas audio box interface, and that's going straight to Studio One software. No bells and whistles, just the raw tone of the cabinet. And for the guitar, of course, I'll be using my trusty Gibson Les Paul Traditional Pro.
So yeah, for me, this cabinet blows me away. At the price point and the sound of those real Vintage 30 speakers, it's unbeatable. So if you're on a budget, I would definitely recommend checking one of these guys out, especially if you're trying to do some hard rock, heavy metal tones, because this thing is just it's excellent for the job. Thanks so much for watching the video. If you leave a like and subscribe, that would be awesome. As always, if you have any questions, feel free to leave them in the comments section below, and I will answer them. But other than that, I guess I'll see you guys next time.